Chester A. Arthur is one of the most forgettable presidents. He was born in Fairfield, Vermont in 1828. He later enrolled at Union College in 1845. During his breaks, he was a teacher. In 1848, he was a teacher and on the side, he began to pursue his education in law. Later, he was admitted to New York City, where he joined the Culver Law Firm, where he did many small cases. In 1861, he became a staff of the governor in the Civil War. While Chester was vice president, the president at the time, James A. Garfield, was assassinated in Baltimore. Over the course of the next two days, he retook the oath of office and became the president. During his presidency, he formed a stronger navy and improved upon civil rights. In the election of 1884, he was beat by Grover Cleveland. At the age of 57, he passed away.